I'm Stacy, Marketing Director and Creative Technology Nerd at Stephen Buren Roofing, Windows and Flooring, and this is four simple things you can do for longer lasting carpet. Did you know that long lasting carpet really has little to do with the carpet itself? Yes, I hear you saying, but Stacy, there are literally hundreds of variations of carpet thickness, chemical composition, and stain resistant coatings that all tout durability. And you are absolutely right. Each of those variations does have its own set of benefits and drawbacks that do affect longevity to some extent. But much like your car, your carpet's longevity really has more to do with how you care for it than whatever bells and whistles it has. Here are four simple things you can do to make any carpet, any carpet, looking newer, longer. Number one, absolutely invest in a good carpet pad. This is huge. This is ginormous. And if you happen to be installing new carpet sometime in the near future, do invest in a good carpet pad. For just a few cents more per square foot, that equals out to 20 to $30 per room. You can increase the life of your carpet. Here's why. Carpet padding for the last, mm, 60, 70 years has been composed of recycled bits of foam. This might be couches and chairs and who knows what else. This is the, our apartment grade, what we call the apartment grade, and it's, it's kind of squishy. It's intended if you're going to be changing your carpet out every year or so. Most people don't. This is a little bit thicker, a little bit more firm, a little bit denser. This has the same problem as this, is that they are both they're both very porous. Imagine the Great Dane piddling on the carpet and that liquid going straight through the carpet, straight through the carpet pad and into the concrete subfloor below. Concrete is also very porous and will soak that stuff right up. This stuff, this stuff is what we call at Stephen Beer and Roofing Windows and Flooring, this is what we call our astronaut pad. It is still recycled, but it's not as obviously recycled. It is made up of homogenous, homogenous, homogenous foam that is sealed on both sides. So not only is it moisture resistant from moisture coming out of the concrete or from uh, under a pier and beam, but, but also moisture coming in from the top, say a spilled drink, a dog having an accident, and also, have you ever taken carpet up after it's been down for several years and there's like dust and stuff, dust and dirt underneath? That is because over the years, the dirt particles filter down through the carpet, through the carpet backing, through the pad, and onto the subfloor below. And it stays there like little bits of sand continuing to rub away at whatever's sitting on top of it every time you step. Number two, vacuum. Dirt that gets into and stays in. The backing fibers, they act like those exfoliating beads in the face wash you use, and they slowly, they slowly wear at the bases, base of the fibers with every step you take. Number three, vacuum. Seriously, at least once a week. More if you can. I know it's a pain, but you want to keep those sandblasting little fibers out of the backing of your carpet and especially keep them from going through to the pad below. Seriously! Number four, have your carpet cleaned professionally at least every other year. Every year, if you can. These guys are not going to cut it. They are great for spot cleaning, small areas, like that Great Dane piddling in the carpet. But they're not good, not good, not good for full room or full house cleaning. It simply does not have the power to suck out most of the, the moisture from your carpet. Those rental machines you can find in grocery stores, 
they're not any better. A professional carpet cleaner with truck mounted equipment is going to take the utmost care of your carpet because they truly know what they're doing and their equipment is going to be better able to truly clean your carpet. And here's the best part. Even if you're not installing new carpet anytime soon, you can commit today to taking better care of the carpet you have to prolong its life. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out our other videos, maybe even subscribe, and visit us online at www.stephenburen.com. Have a wonderful day.